Today, back in solo queue, well, uh, I really have no idea who to pick, but you probably have an idea since you saw the thumbnail or the title. But for now, let's ban Curly Tops here because I don't want him in any of my games today. So I have no idea if my teammates are gonna tank, but we're gonna lock in this Ice Lady because I've already made up my mind and she's one of the few remaining mages that I haven't played yet. So hopefully this is gonna be a good game. So for the setup, we're gonna go with Flicker, of course, and we're gonna go with that Mage Talent that uh, burns enemies and gives us a little bit mana back. And for the build, we are gonna go with this one. Let's see, should I get Boots first or actually let's go with Elegant Gem. That might be a better choice. Not only it makes us elegant, we also get uh, HP regen and mana regen whenever we level up. And now that we help Roger with just that one skill, we are going to make sure that we clear this wave while at the same time trying to avoid any damages or dodging any skills that this floating baby might throw at us. And it looks like our tank might need our help here a little bit. He might have been resetting and pissing off the enemies by being annoying around their buff. But let's just get this Bulbasaur. And this Chang is being very, very persistent. I think she needs to cool down a little bit. And it looks like she didn't see that Roger is coming. She usually does. She says that, right? I should probably report this uh, Roger to the FBI, but unfortunately, I've lost their phone number. Now, the turtle is up, but everyone's still busy fighting on both sides of the map. So I'm just going to push this wave a little bit. But now that our jungler is here and so is our tank, we can now safely enter the turtle cooking area. Actually, let's uh, go here and move to the back line so that we can keep throwing ice cubes on the enemies. And it looks like my teammates switched to engaging the enemy, so that's pretty good. I don't know what this Chang is thinking. Maybe she's not, but we got a turtle. So all that's left now is to clean up this mess and just rack up on assist as we throw our skill 1 and skill 2 to whoever is in front of us. Wow, this Roger is pretty good, isn't he? It looks like the solo queue RNG gods are on our side in this game. So I don't think I need to go anywhere. I mean, I could help Cho, but I can just stay here and wait for Roger to get us some turtle. Wow, it looks like Cho did a really good job in distracting the enemies. Now it's our turn to hunt the Chinaman Hunters. It's ice to see you again, Chang -e. You are looking pretty cool. Hey guys, take me with you. I don't want to go anywhere else without these two because they've been doing really good so far. But yeah, mostly because I'm not dying when I go with them and I also have a chance of securing kills. But since you got that tower, I'm gonna go back to mid lane and stay really safe while clearing the minions. But it looks like we are missing out on a lot of action. So let's head over there and maybe throw an ice cube or two so that we can get an assist. And if we're lucky, then we can secure a kill. Yeah, we had to go there. They totally needed our help. Am I right? And now that the turtle is up again, it is time for another round of rest and relaxation while hiding in the bushes. Dude, find your own bush. I found this bush first. Oh, you listened? Okay. Alright, well, that was a hassle-free turtle secure. That's very good. And now it's time to head to the top lane because I don't think we've been here for the entire game. So it's good that the party's here and we are in the back line. I said in the back line, so don't push that robo guy near me. And it looks like the enemies are getting wiped out. Oh, I didn't even notice that goose in there. Well, unfortunately for him, Roger noticed his existence. Man, I swear, they should just call solo queue a uh, gotcha queue because uh, you never know when you'll get a Roger that is good and you'll never uh, know when you'll uh, get me in your team. So the top lane towers are all cleaned up. My teammates are focusing on getting the bot lane. In the meantime, I'm going to focus on traumatizing this Chang e and make sure that she doesn't go near any bushes for the rest of her life. It's for the best. 
Now it looks like my teammates would like to take down this tower and I would like that idea especially when Cho delivers a free kill for me. So that's very nice of him. I should probably help him out because he's getting chased by this robo guy here who will die in a split second. Wow. I should probably learn how to uh, play Roger. He's, he's pretty strong, isn't he? Is he hard to play or what? Let me know down in the comment section below. And while you're at it, leave a like if you want this Paquito to die. It's all up to you. If you leave a like now, then he will die. Oh, too bad. You were too late. But you left a like though. You left a like, right? Should I take this blue and be a really good teammate and last hit it? Nah, I, I really don't need it. Oh, but Chang'e is giving us a golden shower here. I mean, like I said, I'm not really a fan of that. And Robo Guy is here, so we probably should get out of this entire area where we could die. Oh, look at my teammates. They all switched to Robo Guy in an instant. They must really hate that guy. Meanwhile, the entire enemy team is, uh, is here, and it looks like my teammates really don't need me at this point. And Roger got the Lord. So I guess it's time to head to one of the lanes and maybe camp in one of the bushes nearby. I mean, this is a perfect bush that I'm camping in, but if my teammates are gonna scare the enemies away, then it's going to bankrupt our popsicle business. So let's just deliver these ice creams to the enemy's front door and hopefully we can push this lane so we can get inside their base where we can deliver to more customers. All right, it seems like everyone did a good job in opening up all the doors for us in the enemy's base and all that's left to do now is wait for the right time to sell our product to a lucky customer and it looks like we have one now and it's gonna be this annoying panchito man all these ice cubes i'm throwing at your face and you still got no chill i guess i should kick your eyes haha <laughs> that doesn't really work what should work though is if we keep pushing with four of us here and two enemies left then this game should be over in a flash but we still gotta worry about this rafaela because she's crashing our cool party am i right haha <laughs> Oh no, Paquito is here and he killed Tigreal. Oh man, I, I see what you did there. Silvana and I is pretty injured, but we got Roger here who's getting ulted by Robo Guy. It's a good thing we got back up from me hitting that blue buff. Don't worry, I'll make up for it by not dying to this Gushin because he also has auto aiming problems. And all we gotta do now is not go inside that bush because there he is. I see what you are trying to do there. All right, is that, is that better? And now it's time for round two in the attempt to end this game. Hopefully we can take down all of them. And there we go. It's an enemy wiped out. And all we got to do is stay in the frame. But we didn't. All right, you can see my head, right? So that's fine. I'll still count this as a victory selfie, which I am included in. So that, my friends, is Aurora or also known as Budget Eudora. Unless she got improved or buffed, then I still think that Eudora is a little bit better. Just because that she needs stacks to get a stun out, but she's pretty good. So I hope you enjoyed this video and I hope you're having a nice day. Again, my name is Shin Mentagazo. Thank you so much for watching these videos. Hit that like and subscribe if you enjoyed. Check out the previous videos for other heroes that I played in the past. And as always, I will see you guys in the next video. Peace.